When was the first time you spoke to somebody today? Not to Siri, but to an actual person. The pace of innovation is quite impressive. Here's a gloomy forecast, though. 65% of the jobs in Las Vegas will be replaced by robots over the next two decades. Is automation a real threat to the hospitality industry? In the beginning, I was very skeptical about automation because I value human interaction, high touch, and service delivery. At first, I wanted to contend that robots will never be able to replace our frontline employees. While I was interviewing the robotics company, I found out a very interesting fact. Robots are more accepted in Asia than in the United States. This was the big transition of my research. My question was, why is that? In fact, a concierge robot was implemented at a hotel in the United States, but after a few months of wow, it disappeared. A robot hotel in Japan operated by 150 robots is now planning to open eight more locations by next year. So what makes Asian countries more accepting of robotics technology? Are there any distinctive cultural differences? I came up with a tipping culture. The custom of tipping matters. This is where my thesis comes in. I'll examine the influence of patron and employee relationships on acceptance of robotics in the workforce. There are different attitudes of customers toward the tipping custom in Asia and the United States. In the US, Customers are aware of positive effects of tips on service quality, and most of them want to retain their freedom, how much to reward the waiter, and oppose to replacing tipping with the service charges. My research includes how the custom of tipping relates to customer experience. Robots provide one-time service, but the relationship between patrons and employee create the cycle of the service experience. Robots may break this cycle by taking away customers' role to participate in the process of service. My research will provide a better understanding of a customer's perception and guide the robotics company how to integrate robots which will benefit customers and employees. A housekeeping robot will bring your toothbrush when you're in pajamas. Also, employees can cooperate with the multilingual robots for our international guests. There are fears of robots replacing humans, but with the technology in place, new jobs are being created. While robots take care of the simple, repetitive jobs, employees can proactively engage with the customers to provide a better service experience. In this way, robots will be more welcomed in hospitality. My job is to make sure when you see robots at a hotel, robots are there to serve people, not to replace or take away human jobs. Thank you very much. <laughs>